the resolution good? Good? No, it's terrible. <gasps> it's starting. It's kinda loud looking. Looks loud to me. Oh, Splatoon. Oh. But like, near. <laughs> With the robot and everything. It's like, it's like the portal. The portal liquids. <laughs> Have noses. <laughs> ah. Marina and Pearl. Where? Color palette. Oh, like paint chips? This is like near. <laughs> Is it another forty-four dollars? Fifty dollars for DLC? Near roguelike? I don't know. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's nice Nintendo captions. Direct. You just saw a new trailer for Wave Two of the Splatoon Three Expansion Pass cool DLC color. Side Order. This brand new story is set in the Spire of Order, where you will strengthen your character's abilities as you ascend the Spire's floors. <laughs> We're developing this single-player DLC so it can be played over and over Colors again. Colors are pretty. So pastel. It's to release in Spring 2024, <laughs> so please look forward to it. Okay, let's see our first batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. Donkey the toys Kong. are back in town. Toys? Donkey oh. Kong. Mario. Oh. The rivalry that heated up on the Game Boy Advance system reignites on the Nintendo Switch system. With his eyes on the prize, Donkey Kong has stolen all the mini Mario toys from the factory. And it's up to Mario to track him down. In each stage, contraptions and other challenges await. The mini Marios are so cute. <laughs> Observation and action are vital to your success. It's Mario like a phone needs game. to reach the key, but he can't quite cross the gap. Hmm. That monkey's tail looks a little suspicious, though, doesn't it? If Mario does this, now he can get across. And safely grab the key. Platform too high? Reach it with a handstand jump or a backflip. Like that. Observe and act to collect mini Marios, clear stages, and face Donkey Kong head on. Hail physics. In this updated version of the game, you can play with a friend in local co-op. Oh, puzzles! However you choose to puzzle your way through, puzzles. it's up to you to recover the toys. <coughs> Mario vs. Donkey Kong launches on Nintendo Switch Hashtag February 16th. Mario Donkey Kong. <laughs> begin today on Nintendo Why not the e verses? Save the prince and the world. Oh, what's this again? 
guide Prince of Sargon Persia. as he sets oh. off to save the Prince of Persia and restore the world. Everything balance. looks like a Game Boy game right now. <laughs> Tap into the roots of the Prince of Persia series. This game features 2D side-scrolling action adventure gameplay. Dash through breathtaking environments in a mythological Persian-inspired world, but don't linger too long if you hope to survive. Harness sword and bow techniques, as well as time powers, to best these hostile lands. As your journey progresses, Sounds Sargon like cheating. will grow stronger and learn new abilities that expand his arsenal. Equip amulets to further boost your abilities, among other perks. The number of amulets you can equip is limited, though, so choose wisely. Use everything <laughs> at your disposal to navigate this harsh world and defeat Tell the mythical beasts that no stand way. in your way. Get ready to save the prince. Oh damn, this is 2.5D. When Prince of Persia, <laughs> the Lost Crown, launches on the Nintendo Switch system January 18th. Next year. You can receive the in-game Warrior Within outfit by pre-ordering the game from Nintendo eShop. The captions are pretty far behind, it looks like. These games will help you chase your passions. Chase, chase. Rev up for uh. true arcade racing in Horizon Chase 2. Look. Speed through <laughs> stunning environments, each with its own dynamic art style. While we really are doing PS1 games. <laughs> play the main campaign to unlock vehicles, courses, and more. You can also upgrade your vehicle and style it to fit your high octane needs. Itching Some for more Grand Turismo. <laughs> Up to four speedsters can put the pedal to the metal in couch co-op or online. This is like the Fortnite of uh, <laughs> racing games. Later today. Warm up for musical mayhem in this rhythm-based adventure. Time your button presses with the music to solve puzzles and battle bosses. Over 30 right. thrilling tracks await, including music from iconic Konami games. Up to four friends can battle it out in versus modes or jam together cute. in local or online play. Super Crazy Rhythm Castle launches on Nintendo Switch November Rhythm 14th. Game? Pre orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Oh, but how much? Tell me how much. Anya. Anya Forger has a new assignment from Sugoi. school creating <laughs> a photo diary. On weekdays, you'll head to class, then enjoy family time in the evenings. On days off, you can visit oh. all sorts of exciting places, like the beach or an art museum, in search of subjects to photograph. This was How will you spend your time with friends and family? And what kind of photo diary will you help Anya make? Spy Anya Operation Memories launches on Nintendo Switch next year. I, uh, I don't know what to think about that. Mario's first RPG adventure oh, returns. It's back. The Super Mario RPG game is back with updated graphics. Let's go over some new and returning gameplay features. Time your button presses with action commands to increase damage dealt or decrease damage received. When you time your attacks perfectly, you can now damage all enemies at once. Ah. Every successful action command will fill this gauge. When it's full, you can unleash the three-character triple move. Depending on your current party, the move will change, so experiment with different combos. During your adventure, you'll encounter bosses with colorful personalities. After clearing the game, you can fight some of them again. But these powered-up bosses aren't going to be easy. Set off for adventure with Mario and Friends when Super Mario RPG launches on the Nintendo Switch system November 17th. Uh, Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo uh, Switch. <laughs> hey. Oh, come. Uh, Look alive. We're almost there. Uh, Skyrim. <laughs> The oh. Nintendo DS game, Trace Memory, returns on the Nintendo Switch system as another code to memories. One day, a young girl named Ashley receives a letter from the father she thought had passed away. Seeking answers, she sets off for the solitary Blood Edward Island in search of him. 
Once there, Ashley uh -huh. encounters puzzles and obstacles that hinder her investigation. a mysterious boy what truths await ashley in this place and no matter how hard i try i can't remember dad's face who are you the sequel another code r memories, <laughs> previously unreleased in north america is also included so this is like juliet huh oh. Play both games to experience the full story. Oh. Unravel both adventures. Fully the enhanced collection. for Nintendo Okay, Switch, the first one and the sequel. Code, recollection launches January 19th. Oh. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. A person. <sighs> Another code recollection includes two games. The Nintendo DS game Trace Memory and its Wii sequel which was never released in North America. A both penguin. games are fully enhanced on Nintendo Switch. Please look forward to playing them early next year. Next, uh. please take a look at this. Uh. This one? One day, a loyal toad presented a flyer advertising a show at the Sparkle Theater. Princess Peach and some toads went to go see it, but then... Uh. The Wicked Grape and the Sour Bunch suddenly made their grand entrance and took center stage. Now, it's up to Peach and the theater's guardian Stella to save the play and the day. Oh. This perfect performance has become a terrible tragedy. Luckily, Peach can use the power of Stella's ribbon to face off against the Sour Bunch. Ribbon alone won't always cut it, though. So let's do this. Whoa, Peach transformed oh. into Sword Fighter Peach. By transforming, she can use fantastic oh. show stopping abilities. Fend off the Sour Bunch with sensational sword play. Oh. Can Peach save this performance and its performers? It looks cool. There are more stolen shows to save. <laughs> Valuable artifacts from this museum have gone missing. Become Detective Peach, investigate clues, and track down who done it. Desserts have been snatched from this sweets festival. Turn into Patissier Peach and save it from a sugar crash. The Sour Bunch got their hands on this martial arts school. Become Kung Fu Peach and take it back from these foul fiends. Oh, they're telling us everything, huh? <laughs> Many other transformations are just behind the curtain. Okay. The stage is set. Our leading lady is ready Watson. for the spotlight. Princess Peach Showtime makes its debut uh, on Nintendo Switch March 22nd. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Pre-order today for March. That was a new look at Princess Peach Showtime. In Peach's latest adventure, the gameplay changes depending on her transformations. It looks like there are more transformations beyond the ones we showed today, so please stay tuned. Let's continue with some more headlines. A new saga begins. A multi-layered RPG full of rich stories awaits oh. in Saga Emerald Beyond. Saga. There are six heroes to choose from. Oh. A young man who fights with sentient puppets. Um. A witch disguised as a schoolgirl to mask her identity. A crime-fighting duo chasing down a mysterious organization. A songstress mech who lost her voice and body. 
Select a uh. hero, then follow their journey through 17 interconnected worlds as they strive to achieve their goals. How the story unfolds is in your hands. The choices you make can unlock different paths more than ever before seen in the Saga franchise. Uh. Fight in timeline battles, turn-based combat in which turn order is crucial to victory. Use special techniques to control the order of actions or activate team combos to swing the, UI the tide is of battle kind of in confusing. your <laughs> Saga Emerald Beyond launches on Nintendo huh. Switch next year. Next year. The Legendary Raider returns. Uh. The first three Tomb Raider games, all with upgraded visuals, are venturing onto Nintendo uh. Switch in one uh. daring collection. As the fearless archaeologist, Lara Croft, you'll travel the world and face off against deadly foes and even deadlier legends. Climb, backflip, and swan dive through perilous quests spanning different countries and mythologies. Along the way, you'll solve puzzles to uncover treasures of the ancient world and unravel mysteries lost to the ravages of time. This faithfully remastered trilogy comes with all of the expansions and secret levels for each game. You can also toggle between the original polygon look and the upgraded visuals at any time. Tomb Raider 1 through 3 Remastered, starring Lara Croft, launches on the Nintendo Switch system February 14th. Pre-orders <laughs> begin today on Nintendo eShop. This detective's got a uh, second bolt of brilliance. Again. Every great detective starts their day early. This is Rhyme City, a place where humans <laughs> and Pokemon coexist. The detective duo of Pikachu and his partner Tim investigate various cases while searching for Harry, Tim's missing father. Tim interviews people. Pikachu interviews Pokemon, and they find the truth together. They'll also rely on other Pokemon uh, wait, to broaden that's the how scope his of mouth their works? investigations. <laughs> Follow Sense with Growlithe. Uh. Smash Rocks with Darmanitan. And Peer Through Walls with Luxray. Uh. Can Tim and Pikachu solve all the mysteries and find Harry? Find out when Detective Pikachu returns. Launches on Nintendo Switch October 6th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. This game's a real toot. Trombone uh, champ. Raise your brass for the quirky rhythm game, Trombone Champ. Play the notes in time with the music as best you can. But how you play that horn is up to you. You can use gyro controls to adjust the pitch up and down. Or the IR motion camera on the right Joy-Con controller. The controls are pretty unique. And mastering every control scheme won't be a walk in the park. Honk your way through nearly 50 songs spanning various genres, from classical to electronica and everything it's in between. Funny looking. Plus, up to four musicians I, I've never thought about together playing it or in local anything. multiplayer. Trombone Champ slides onto Nintendo Switch later today. Battle your way to victory in these Nintendo Switch games. Uh, Ten teams of three back, will duke it out for survival in this online Come battle back. royale brawl. Uh, battle royale. Knock your opponent's battle health down to zero MC's and song. deliver a finishing blow. I forget or who shove them off what the MC Soft made again. It's like, Choose from 15 it heroes, each inspired by a different BNS? mythology. Work with know. your allies to be the last team standing. Battle Crush is free to play and launches first for consoles on Nintendo Switch next spring. A closed beta test will be available this October. 
lead your mercenaries to fame and fortune in this open world tactical RPG. Take up various contracts from protecting townsfolk from thieves to vanquishing the land's most notorious figures. Before battle, equip your mercenaries with the best gear and skills to claim victory and live to see another day. Up to four players online can jointly command a troop and journey together across this vast world. War Tales launches as a timed console exclusive on Nintendo Switch later Hi. today. <laughs> Run and gun in this reimagining of the beloved NES classic, Contra. Blast through explosive huh? stages with a devastating Wait, arsenal Contra. of weapons I'm to crush the Red Falcon forces. Galaga. Spring into action with easy pick up and play controls and a variety of difficulty options. This reimagining from Konami and Way Forward features new weapons, enemies, powerful super attacks a four-player co-op mode. Contra, Operation Galuga, storms onto the Nintendo Switch system early um. next year. Liberate your kingdom. Reclaim your destiny. Tis a grievous tale which speaks of Febreth, one of stolen destiny, stolen minds, and stolen nations. Yet, as the world stands consumed by immense evil, a fallen prince shall rise again, ring of legend lighting his path. That is the ring of the unicorn, ancestral treasure of Cornea's royal lineage. <laughs> legend speaks of your ancestors wielding it to purify evil. That's kind of cool, Yet though. The answer is clear as day now. The path before us is laid bare, and all that kinda remains gives. now is to walk it. Walk it, I will, mother. Yeah, I feel a little bit of adventure quest. <laughs> traverse an expansive world. Gather new allies, forge your bonds, and lead the liberation to glorious victory. Cultivate a grand army with over 60 unique characters, from humans and elves to massive beasts and heavenly angels. Today marks our first foray into the mists of despair which hang heavy over our home. It may take days, months, or even years, but I shall see the duties of my bloodline fulfilled. Atlas and Vanillaware present the rebirth of tactical fantasy RPGs. Unicorn Overlord. Available March 8th, 2024. Uh, is back? Again? Luigi! <laughs> Luigi's Mansion 2 HD! Oh. Huh? <laughs> Welcome to Evershade Valley, a place that's screaming and teeming with the supernatural. Luigi, our faint of heart hero, was sent here to check it out. Time for some mansion mayhem. I forgot that we're at three now. <laughs> no spooky adventure is complete without this vacuum-like so device. <laughs> the gust. Use it to Not light up hotel. dark areas, vacuum up objects, and interact with the environment. It's a handy tool for your uh, paranormal escapades. Drink. <laughs> Plus, when you spot a ghost, pop! You can stun them with the strobe ball, then vacuum them up. You can even grab multiple ghosts at once. I don't know much about this, the second one. In this game, you'll find ghosts haunting, a former plant research lab, a broken down clock factory that's full of sand, a mine covered in ice and snow, and Apparently, even more places. maybe the boss ghosts weren't as interesting in this one. Will use every trick in the Not as memorable as the first one. Can Luigi summon his courage and save the day? There's a lot of monsters, though. Looking for other ghost hunters? Up to four players online can do some exercise across different multiplayer modes. Luigi's Mansion 2 HD creeps onto Nintendo Switch next summer. How was that?
Next, <laughs> we have two announcements to share. First one was kind of a little bit scary. Please take a look at this video. More Mario. This is Maker. No. What's that? It's a large question block. Actually, this question block currently appears on the roof of the previously announced Nintendo Gallery that's under construction oh. in Uji City, Kyoto Prefecture. Cute. The official name of this gallery will be the Nintendo Museum. That's, that's kind of funny, though. Nintendo Museum, you look at the overhead map and you see a question mark the block. History will be displayed. Construction is going well, and we plan to finish up by March 2024. We'll share more information, such as the opening date, at another time. What are they gonna do? Please sculptures? Concept art? Next, theme park? we'd like to share some updates on upcoming amiibo figures. <laughs> the Zelda and Ganondorf amiibo figures oh, are releasing he's on November buff. 3rd. And amiibo figures of Noah and Mio from the Xenoblade uh -huh. Chronicles 3 game will be released as a set on January 19th, 2024. I and forgot finally, that. <laughs> we have a new amiibo figure to announce. The DLC fighter from Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, Sora from Kingdom Hearts, is on the way. Yeah, I was just thinking. With the release of Sora, everyone is here from Super Smash Bros. Ultimate in amiibo form. Please look forward to its release. I, but I just year. remember they're not putting any more fighters in, but I was like, oh, they're bound to put That's in. That's all for today's amiibo announcements. Xenoblade 3, Next, uh, please Kotax. take a look at this. <laughs> F zero, but just a port. It's just a port, the first isn't it? F zero game returns as a ninety nine player battle royale. Oh, <laughs> yeah. F zero ninety nine. Mm, it's a temporary Race on again. Classic F zero courses with machines from the original Super NES. Looks kind of funny though. <laughs> through courses in high-speed races, but be careful. Your power meter will decrease if you crash into pilots or guardrails. If Everyone's it hits gonna zero, die. You're out. You'll need to avoid collisions and conserve your power meter to stay in the race. Feeling risky? Spend some of your power meter for a temporary speed boost. You can also collect super sparks, which like appear when machines uh... collide. F zero DX. It was really cool. The Skyway. It's your best <laughs> chance at bypassing your rivals and jumping into a higher position. Complete goals while you're racing to unlock cosmetic options for your machine. Cosmetics. We love cosmetics. Ninety-nine players. One winner. It's time to race your way to first place. Because F-099 will be available exclusively for active Nintendo Switch online members later today. Ah, right. Another 99 game, but not More than temporary. More years after its original release, F-0 is back as a battle royale game. This title also supports the Super NES controller available exclusively for Nintendo Switch online members. We hope you will give it a try and aim for first place. Okay, let's continue with some more headlines. One little hero, one humongous problem. Welcome to Vandal City, a whimsical land inhabited by small fuzzy beings called Yordles. After a party gets a little too wild, a League the of Legends holding story? the land together collapse and throw everything into chaos. It's up to you and your knitting magic to stitch Vandal City back together. Journey across the land to gather materials and craft items and meals for the locals. As you continue gathering and crafting, you, should, you, should get you can it weave you, uh, together new upgrades if you play by games unlocking for it. more branches of the skill tree. Enchant your experience even further by embarking Fishing. on quests and hosting festivals for the community. Can you save this is like Vandal an old City? School and what MMO. mysteries will you discover during your magical adventure? <laughs> it's like a RuneScape. 
Vandal Tale, a League of Legends story, launches on Nintendo Switch next year. Wait, did you hear that? A fast Join show. best friends, Nunu and Willem, on a journey across the frozen wilds of the Freljord. Jump, climb, and sled your way through a beautiful yet treacherous land, where every step taken and each puzzle solved will bring you closer to the truth about these friends and their past. Song of Nunu, a League of Legends Another story, one. launches on the Nintendo Switch system November 1st. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Let's move into formation. Ah, I like WarioWare. This tropical resort contains tons of micro games that'll get your body moving. In each micro game, you'll get into a specific pose called a form. Copy the form shown, then perform the correct action as quick as you can. Hand model. The micro games will come one after another, so look alive. Plus, up to four players can battle it out in party mode. Reach the goal without getting uh. caught by Medusa. <laughs> Free. Or settle the score in an arena to be the last one posing. With over 200 lightning fast micro games and multiplayer modes of plenty, <laughs> everyone's in for a wacky time. Wario I always liked Wario I Nintendo like the mini game. November 3rd. Uh, Pre orders are available games, now like on Nintendo eShop. Raymond Raving Rabbits and the Mario Party. Soon unfold. What's this? Lead an army of over 100 heroes into battle and put Ooh. an end to an empire's invasion. Aiden Noah, a humble villager. Very humble. <laughs> Sane, an officer from the Empire, and Marissa, a forest guardian. Uh -huh. These three band together to fight for a common goal. On their journey, they'll meet a variety of heroes who can join their Sharks. cause. <laughs> this is your home base, known as the headquarters. Uh -huh. As allies join you, additional facilities will become available. You'll be able to tend crops, open shops, and more. Each hero you encounter has their own backstory and motivation. They may not always get along at first, but these conflicts may strengthen the bonds between your heroes. Trust, betrayal, justice, and truth. A heroic tale will begin when Ayudin Chronicle 100 Heroes launches on Nintendo Switch April 23rd. It's like a passion project. Pretty cool. Participate in some pixel perfect play. Huh. Next Eastward. Stop, Octopia. Travel East to a charming Wait. parallel yeah, world. Eastward. With paid DLC for Eastward. Help Sam and John turn the pages of a new chapter as they adjust to country life in a mountainside village. Tend to livestock. This Whip game has the prettiest pixel art. And restore buildings to help the village thrive. And if you're new to Eastward, don't worry. You can access the DLC even if you haven't played the main story. Eastward Octopia ventures onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Get back into the groove. In this sequel to War Groove, charge across three tactical campaigns with valiant factions, including a new mouse folk faction, the Fari. Plus, you can now supercharge your commander's groove to unleash devastating attacks. Lead a roguelike offensive in conquest Excited. mode. Excited. I'm a little tired, actually. Battle and friends I'm still locally, feeling a little tired, but it looks cool. Or create and share your I own haven't properly and campaigns. woken up, I guess. War Groove 2 marches onto Nintendo Switch as a this console is like Advanced Wars. <laughs> Some Fire 
alive and catch fish by Giant day. Giant blue hole. Then serve them as sushi by night and the aquatic adventure, Dave the Diver. Ah, next one. Next one. Use the fish you've caught to concoct recipes and create the day's menu. Then tend to the clamoring customers at your sushi restaurant. Explore an ever-changing underwater world to find the best ingredients and strive to exceed culinary expectations. Dave the Diver launches first for consoles on the Nintendo Switch system October 26th. Pre-orders and a free demo swim onto Nintendo eShop later today. This is so weird. <laughs> The final wave is racing in. Uh, Here's a sneak peek at wave six, the final wave of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. From the Mario Kart Wii game, Daisy Circuit. More returning characters are also being added in wave six. From the Mario Kart Double Dash game, Diddy Kong. From Mario Kart Wii, Funky Kong. Funky Kong. And from the Mario here. Kart Tour game, Pauline! <laughs> and also, Peachette! Uh oh! Wave 6 of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC ah, for the Mario so Kart 8 Deluxe though. game drives onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Uh -huh. Active Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Something new is among us. Uh -huh. Hi, hi Satan Sun. Among us. Airship. Oh. Ah. Fungus. Fungus among us. The magic punch! The fungal. This new map for Among Us is free and launches this October. Ah. Oh, funny. What did you think? Thanks for sticking with us this far. Next up, we'd like to recap some of the previously announced Nintendo titles you can look forward to playing from September onwards. Let's take a look. Ah. Uh. We hope you're looking forward to these upcoming titles. This next video will be our last announcement. Please uh. take a look. Uh. Mario? What? Sunshine? Paper? Paper. The music's good. Again? Wait. Thousand year door? Uh. They look so nice. Uh. 
Remember this. <laughs> Twenty four Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door, originally released on Nintendo GameCube, will return with enhanced graphics. Whether you played the original or have yet to play it, we hope you'll look forward to experiencing this adventure in a paper world starring Mario and friends. Mm. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. Uh. Uh. That's it.